It's actually the wrong verb to use. It shouldn't be to look, it should be to hear. If we go to our visual EQ and we turn this on, you might be aware that we have this analyzer. So we can actually visualize it. And that will show us all of the different frequencies. So what Sion's saying is what you can do is use that, but then also grab LRC7. So if you want to visually identify some frequencies that you may not want, then you can do that. You can come in here, you can play this, and let's just say that, say you really didn't want this low down bit going on here. Well, you could roll it off there, or you could identify and you could say that this stuff down here at between 100 and 200 Hertz is say interfering with my bass. It's not, but let's just say it is. And then you could come in here to LRC7 and you could come in here and you could add a filter. In fact, you could, you could make it even easier. You could just come in here and you could do the cut lows and highs and then you could just bring this one and say, right, everything below like 200 hertz, we're going to roll off like that and then get... Uh, and you get like a thinner sound because you're not getting that bass sound and then come back to here to your, your uh, visualizer and say, yay, look, I've removed all those pesky frequencies down below. But here's the thing. Mix with your ears, not your eyes, when at all possible. So the, the challenge, the problem you have with using, if you use the analyzer too much, you're going to start looking for things to change, not listening for things to change. Now, it can work sometimes with some types of music and with some things, or say you've got a real sort of harsh S sound or some popping P's and you can identify them. You can't find them by sweeping. You can't find them by doing this and sweeping your range, but you can find them by putting your analyzer on and seeing them. Cool. Use it. But I've seen too many people come in and they're like, oh, I don't know what to EQ. Wait a minute, I'll look. It's actually the wrong verb to use. It shouldn't be to look, it should be to hear. So if you're using your eyes too much and using your ears too little, then that can be a challenge. Really good tip though. Not, not saying that Sion's not right here. It is. If you need to find it, if you need to have an analyzer, use these two in conjunction. And you can, of course, have them both on at the same time. You can use multiple. Make sure you do have them at the very bottom of your plug-in chain though. Generally speaking, you want to have your EQ at the end as opposed to up here at the start. So I'd put it just above your visual EQ there.